Hi guys, today I'm going to make a quick tutorial on how to use the VEX V5Z Path Planner. So first thing you want to do is you want to come into your browser and you want to search up GitHub. Um, so you're going to come to here and you're going to come up into the search box up here, click this and you're going to search up VEX V5Z Path Planner. And first one here that comes up, click on this and give it a star while you're there and then come down to here where it says use here and we're going to click on this link and it takes us to the website so the first thing that you can do is you can make a straight line with two points um, add more points after that and drag your points around and then you can go click the play button and the robot will follow your path at the so the white line out the front is the heading of the robot and okay say that we want we're here but we want to make a nice curve around here so what we're going to do is we're going to right click on here and it gives us these two blue dots so we're going to drag these dots out and see we can make a curve uh, next feature that we have is we have this we can change the size and dimensions of our robot So say we have a really small robot like I don't know, 15 inches by 15 inches And so now when we click play we have a lot smaller robot Or if we want we can change it to 18 by 18 and now we have a bigger robot uh, We also have the timer so this is a really good indication of how long your uh, routine is going to take uh, really good for your skills runs and that sort of thing uh, Which if you click you can toggle skills or normal uh, field layout uh, Next thing that we can do is we can click save path and it saves our path so that we can come back and edit it later So if we reload the page obviously re everything resets, but we can click load path come to our downloads This one here open and we've got our path back um, so yeah, that's the V5Z Path Planner. Um, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments down below.